Assalamu alaikum, my lovely grade 2. How are you all? I hope you're fine. Fit and fine, right? That's great. Now it's up the time to study, study and study. You know what? Your exams are also approaching. The exams are here. Don't you think that in the online classes you won't be having exams? Yes, definitely you have exams. So your exams are coming nearer, nearer day by day and we have to prepare for them. Remember, after taking your class, you have to practice whatever you studied with me. You have to discuss it with your parents or your siblings or whosoever is tutoring you these days. Practice concepts, learn things, and that's the thing that you, that can make you successful. All right? English is not the ratta. It's not the things that you have to make them by heart. It's not the cramming stuff. It's the conceptual stuff. All right. So practice it. Ask the, the, the one who are tutoring you or teaching you at home to give you some unseen exercises so that you can practice and you can grasp the concept nicely. All right. So welcome to the classroom. Which classroom is this? Yes, this is our English classroom. Very well done. We, what do we do in English classrooms? We read, we write, we practice grammar and creative as well. Aajkal creative se baat bache hoye aap log. But don't worry, I'm planning it ahead. We'll be having creative together. Today, let's have a short recap of what we did from the booklets. Aapke sabke paas booklets, I hope you have taken, a, borrowed them from the school. Yes. So we have done a few worksheets from this that, that booklet. Those worksheets were... The first one was the use of is, am, are, the helping verbs, right? Remember? Yes. The second one was the use of articles. If you remember, which articles? A, uh, an, and the. Very well done. So today we are up with another worksheet from this booklet. I hope you'll enjoy this. The concept of has and have is very, very easy and I hope you're enjoying it. Once again, let's repeat who are the magic pronouns? I and you. Yes, and what do they always carry? They always carry have with them. Excellent. Now, let's move on to the next portion, next half of this page. Point number nine, they dash an orange and a tomato. They, plural, they have an orange and a tomato. Very well done. Anna dash a nice pencil case. Anna has a nice pencil case. Shabash. My brother dash a red pencil. Has a red pencil. Again, we have a magic pronoun. I dash an adventure book. I have an adventure book. Well done. You dash a house in the beach. You have a house in the beach because it is a magic pronoun. Oh, number 14 has two magic pronouns together. You and I dash an idea. Abhi dekho, these are magic pronouns. To vese bhi have aega and they are plural. To isliye bhi have aega. Wow, it was a tricky one. So you and I have an idea. Number 15. My friend dash a sister. Has a sister. Very good job. So what are has and have? They are the helping verbs. And what do they do? They help us complete the sentence. Excellent. What are the magic pronouns? I and you. Good job. And what do the plurals carry? They carry have. And what do the singulars carry? They carry has. Good job. And what is the past of has and have? It's only had. It's only had. Good, 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 good. Achha, if you don't mind, can we do two concepts today? It was a very shorter lecture today, so I planned two concepts to be done today. Because has and have is very easy. So let's do another one today. That is pronouns. Let's see what are they. Here, here, here everyone. This is worksheet number four from the school booklet that you bought. It is pronouns. It is pronouns. What are pronouns? You all already know what are pronouns. We did it in grade one. So you're quite familiar. The words that we use in place of nouns are called pronouns there are some examples also given let's read it i he she it you we they these words are pronouns pronouns are the words that can be used in place of nouns the pronoun i is always written with a capital letter remember okay your personal pronoun bhi kehlata hai your magic pronoun bhi hai so it is always written in the capital when alone either in the first in the middle or in the end of the sentence i is always supposed to be capital very well done 
Now let's move ahead. Let's check the exercise. What a shorter exercise it is. Put the correct pronoun in the blank space. My name is Sam. Dash am six years old. You're talking about your he's talking about his own self. My name is Sam. Dash am six years old. I am six years old or he am six years old. I am six years old. Good job. I have a brother. Dash is ten years old. Brother, he is ten years old or she? What do we use for brother? He excellent job. I also have a sister. Dash is three years old. Sister, brother is he and sister is she. Very good job. My father is 30 years old. Dash goes to office. Father, boy, he goes to office. My mother works at home. She dash, oops, oops, oops. Dash takes care of us. Who takes care of us? Mother. Mother is a girl. What to use? He or she? She. Very well done. My father and mother are very nice. Dash love us very much. They love us very much or we love us very much. They love us very much. Very well done. So these were two very small worksheets we did today together today. They were very easy. The first one was the helping verb has and have, which were, which are used to complete the sentence. The second one was the pronouns. What were the pronouns? The words that replace the nouns. That was a wonderful lecture today. I enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed it too. See ya. Ta da. Bye bye.